For all of our fine ways, we are in danger. For all our virtues, there is a weakness. For every dream, there is a danger. From Principles of Civilization by Wing Tae Sun. Outside of our temples and palaces and libraries are those who care nothing for our fine art and writing and thought. To the south, the Gilzais. To the east, the armies of Nayado's emperor. To the west, the devil's own horsemen. Limitless in ferocity and number, infinite in cruelty, they wait like hunting wolves for a sign of frailty or moment of inattention. Be forever watchful. Should one come to forge the tribes into a killing wind from the west, that will be the last of our days. A people born of a hard and pitiless land, they are from those steppes and wastelands of frost and mud. Cold, without mercy and without end. Skilled are they in war. But in the end, it is their sheer number that may crush us. For they do not invade our lands. They migrate to them. My friend and general. Nubotai, what word do you bring from Zumar? Has the judge surrendered what I ask? Or must we put this entire empire to the sword? Or is it bad news you bring me? The heart. The Phoenix Heart is missing? Then who stole it? I don't know. I never saw it. Someone got there before me? Who told you to steal it? You could not have known Wing Tae Sun held these treasures in his library. I... I can't remember. Let me think. I will give you until sundown tonight to search your memory. Then, your lies will not protect you. The heart must be recovered. You can't remember? I won't tell her anything until I know what this is all about. Boon! We don't have that kind of time. Morons! A simple order. Find a thief trapped within the walls and deny another man exit from the city. You have not found a thief, and you have allowed Nubotai to ride past you. Have you any idea what your actions visit upon this city? Go, find the thief. There may still be time. As you command, Judge Zane. Lost. All is lost. And all because of a single wretched burglar. Are we almost there? Shh. Princess? I thought you might want breakfast. You slept well? A uh, bit restless, Taesu. Not for lack of comfort. Your home is quite charming, and you have made me welcome, even in your time of grief. My father's spirit would not rest easy were I anything less than accommodating to his invited guest. You have been most kind. I must not, however, allow your hospitality to deter me from my task. Hu Xiao! Boon Sai Hang, the entire city is looking for you. And you, though they don't know your part in this. What are you talking about? It was you who went to the library before me. You heard Boss Tiger send me to steal these damn things that everyone is searching for. Both of you are in on this. You know where the Phoenix Heart is. <gasps> See? I know far more than you give me credit for. I know secrets you can only wonder at. A mystical being shares the mysteries of a larger world with me. Popo? Popo? Popo! How will you bring down the judge and make him surrender your prizes? Zuma has stood undefeated for a thousand years. I have a way, Dovotai. 
You have men and horses, great Khan. But it will take more than that. Meet Igor Zubakov. He is from far to the west, a land beyond the steppe. Butokov, you honor me with a visit? This is Nubotai, my chief strategist and advisor. It is good to shake the hand of a fellow warrior. And your expertise is in the area of the siege? To lay low a city, you must use equal parts of force and science. Let me show you my creation. Forged in my native city and brought here, pulled by a score of oxen, it throws a stone ball the weight of a horse for a distance of three leagues. And what do you call this wondrous creation? The mouth of God. Not so loud. My head. You shouldn't drink. Uh, I don't drink enough. Maybe if you eat something. I... That snoring. Oh, my poor head. There is a ring, the book, and the heart. They are of great power and great age. I've heard this. Everyone tells me this. The story must be told from the start, or you cannot understand it. This is one ring, the Ring of Staffs. There are others. Others? How many? Who has them? That is unimportant right now. Each ring grants the wearer mastery over a martial discipline. This one gives the wearer the ability to wield any stick weapon in a manner superior to all others. And the other rings? That is not for you to know. But to own them all... Do not even contemplate that. And the book. The book has powers as well. The work of monks long ago Men driven mad by the very pages they illuminated. I'm not going to open it. Good. I don't like those pictures of hell. Not pictures. A window. A glimpse into the hell of the hungry dragons. And in the wrong hands, a doorway. And the phoenix heart? In many ways, the most significant of them all. And where is that? He has it. He lies to you about it. He's the one who stole it. Hu Jiao raised me from a child. Taught me the art of theft and concealment. Are you saying he's betrayed me? Boss Tiger sent me to steal the heart. Why would Jiao steal it instead? Because I told him to. Foolishness. Judge Zane has us man the ramparts as though for war, but Zumar's walls are impenetrable. What army would dare strike at us? The judge raves and mules like an old woman. If I only... Hold on. What's that sound? A kind of whistling. Father, from the mouth of God and into your stupid faces. We got their range on the first shot. Now shift our aim and we'll begin breaching a wall. Huh? Oh, oh! Snow and thunder? No. It begins. 